So we did a little bit the last few days. Put on that uh, disc brake kit, got rid of all the drums. It was that right stuff kit. Just ordered off Summit, four wheel disc brake. Finished up all the insulation. Seats in here just as a mock-up to see if the uh, shifter would work and it would. Steering column I bought is too long, so we're gonna figure out how to cut it. Insulation in. Then up here we ran some of the brake lines this morning. It worked good. It was uh, a kit as well, the right stuff, same thing. Just a brake line kit. Gonna have to move some of it a little bit. Right there, when we tighten it up, it barely gets off the headers. So we're gonna have to, right there, bend it over a little bit. But the kit came with the whole, the whole thing with the chrome and Brake booster and proportion valve, master cylinder. So yeah, we got some done this week. Gonna have to put connectors on all the wiring and just mock everything up. Put the fender on, wire all the lights, check everything, make sure it's all working. I've got most of the gauges. I mean, it's just the factory, so it's not hard. Got that wired. And then, yeah, we'll just mock it all up, make sure it's running, driving, take it down the road, have some fun with it just in primer. But I mean, it'll be a little bit, but we're about ready to fire the motor just to hear it. Of course, it's just open header there, which I'm getting exhaust Monday put on the Camaro and I'm gonna bring the pipes and the mufflers back home. Worst case, we'll just weld something up down there to it to hold just to hear it. I think he's gonna run the fuel. I think we're gonna do it behind for once. Never done that. I told him, he, you know, it's my dad's car, but I told him we should go ahead and run his temperature over here. Then if you do the fuel in the back, I mean, it'd be clean up front. Put a front end kit on it, and then you just have your hose there, and your hose is coming off here, and then the other ones are hid with the kit. Yeah, it's getting along. Yeah, the guy painting it uh, is supposed to, supposed to get it around October. So it gives us time to get it done. And yeah, I had to order a new one. All this stuff basically. Now these we're gonna use because you can't really see them. But all the chrome on the outside of it'll be new. yeah that's what we did cleaned up the Camaro put back in the cup holders my dad's like you shouldn't have that but they're so nice to have when you're riding down the road got a clean new shifter off put a new filter in today I think everything's good under here now but yeah, the guy who's gonna paint the 55 said that he could take my Camaro here because in the videos, you know, it looks really nice. But I mean, it does have some marks. I mean, we, come on, I mean, we put leaned over, put a new motor in. I mean, there's definitely some bad spots. But anyways, he said he could take the car and just, I guess, buff it down and then put a, uh, and then put uh, like some more clear coat on it. And then buff that and polish it down, make it real nice. But I'm looking forward to it. 
The car is going to be uh, 6000 with the paint job. I think that's an amazing price. Oh, but that's just an update on it now.